Welcome in everyone and welcome back to the channel. I'm AC Kingpin 27 with you today in MLB The Show 22 to continue our Legends roster gameplay series. Today we're grabbing the Cleveland Guardians and we're going to show some ex-Cleveland Indians ball players today. Uh, we're going to get a look at an entire lineup of Legends here for this Cleveland squad as well as some big time pitchers going to be taking the mound for us today. You see we're going to be taking on the Pittsburgh Pir Pirates and I've set these uniforms to be some old school uniforms. You guys are going to have a good uh, a representation of some throwbacks in today's gameplay. As always, guys, drop a like on the video, and I will continue this Legends roster series gameplay we've got going on. I'm enjoying playing these games with all 30 MLB, MLB teams, and we're going to showcase all the Legends that are here in game uh, for all of you guys. Let me know if there's any Legends I may have missed for this Cleveland squad. Leave comments on this video down below, and uh, at the end of the year, maybe we'll get a video of all the Legends that maybe missed or just showed up after we ran that particular team's Legend gameplay. I'm always looking for some extra stuff to do, so I appreciate uh, the love and support you guys are showing here. But let's jump in here and let's take a look at this squad. Uh, you see, we're going to rock the 80s unis. We're going to play at progressive field. We're ready to go. Uh, the old Jake, as they, we like to call it in Cleveland here. And we're going to start with Cliff Lee on the mound uh, today. He's going to get the start, probably go four, maybe five innings, depending on his work. We'll have Burt Bly Levin coming in as well uh, later on in the day. And then I want to also get Bob Feller some love. So he's not a starter with the legend. He actually is a reliever. So uh, we'll bring all three of them in and get them some love and some work in today's game. But Cliff Lee is going to be our starter here. And then you see it, this lineup, very potent. Kenny Lofton is going to be playing left field today. We're going to have a standard shortstop, Ahmed Rosario. Unfortunately, we don't have any Omar Vizquel's or guys like Robbie Alomar we can bring in to this squad. So Ahmed's going to get the start at shortstop. Jim Tomey is going to be your DH today because Eddie Murray is manning first base. Larry Doby is going to be out in center field. I'm actually going to swap, swap this up real quick. We're actually going to put Kenny in center field and Larry Doby out in left. Uh, Jose Ramirez is going to man third base. Grady Sizemore is going to be out in right. Andres Jimenez is going to be at second base. And Austin Hedge is going to be your catcher today. Uh, so that's the way the lineup looks against this Pittsburgh Pirates team. Let's get in here and let's see how this gameplay goes. You see JT Brubaker is going to start for Pittsburgh, and he'll be taking on, like I said, Cliff Lee in this matchup. Enjoy the video, guys. And welcome in, everybody. Glad you're with us. Interleague Baseball on MLB The Show. It's here we the go, Pittsburgh here we go. Pirates taking on Beautiful the Beautiful stadium Guardians. here in Cleveland. It's always fun to bring some legends in, and I think especially for me in this game because it's my hometown Cleveland team. So I'm definitely looking forward to this game here. First Get a look at Cliff Lee away. here. Now the starting I love that it actually looks like him too. Yeah, and when he's right, on, he's a Not the third ball, first I've pitch of the game. Myself. You know, he often takes the pressure off of his hitters to score a lot of runs, but they have to be Ooh. careful to not just go into a slumber. The They've got to put up some runs, make it a little bit easier for this guy That's good for the battle every time that he's out there. No one should be surprised, though. If he settles in and takes See how quick of the game, of the work he can make this first inning here. If you guys are new to the series, I'd like to let the catcher call the game, so... I let this battery pretty much control their destiny. I just like to, to pitch what they call and let these guys get the work done today. So, Unfortunately, the first guy gets a hit here. Man. All right, come on. No big award game this pitching game for Cliff Lee. No shutout. No no hitter, Gamble. no perfect game Gets on the books today. First with nobody out. That's in there. And All the right, count one and one. Man, that two pitch seamer. was dotted. So much talent on display when this guy's out there on the hill. Liner stamped at first. All right, Eddie Murray making a quick play there at, at the first base well, corner. Next, Jack Sawinski. Jack Sawinski. Game calling for a sack bunt. I don't know why you bunt with Sawinski, though. Trying to move him over here. Murray. Who's going to go to first? Second out of the inning, but there is a man that advances the second base here. Let's go. Cliff Lee getting two outs quickly with only eight pitches here. Here's Daniel Vogelback. The designated hitter. Daniel Vogelback. And that one fouled off. There we go. There we go. Get that pitch in there. Get it in there quickly. Two outs. And one in scoring position. Fought off foul. Quickly 0-2 here. What are we going to go with? We want that change up. We're going to go down in here. 
We got the Pittsburgh Unis from like the, the, the mid 90s, and we took the Cleveland Unis from the late 80s here for this matchup. And Cliffley gets the strikeout to Unis, so 3 1. Cliffley giving up no runs here. See JT Brubaker here pitching for the Pirates. We well, see Kenny Lofton going to get the so first look of the game here for Cleveland. Slider, sinker, curveball, changeup for Brubaker here. Early fly ball, though. Going to have to be a little patient by the looks of him with the repertoire of pitches that Brubaker has. And Zep Rosario. Here we go, big man. Puts it in the air. Line drive, but that's going to get caught by the left fielder, huh? Right there to two pitches, the two yeah, outs for two Pittsburgh away. here. That, that brings up Jim Tony. As a kid, I used to hate his little pre-swing adjustments he made in the box. That one lifted to left. Sawinski moving back for this Swing that bad, adjust his cup a little bit, inning. adjust the pant leg. I used to hate that. He took way too much time in the box. Back here at the ballpark. All set for the start All right, of the Cliffy inning. Cliffy going to run inning number Michael two here. Like I said, we'll probably go four or five innings with Cliffy yeah, before we get to Bly Levin. And then we'll finish the game out probably uh, with Bob Feller. We'll see how this one goes and see Pitch. if we're able just to throw those three pitchers today. That catches the corner. Nice this pitch. Originally drafted as a shortstop. He's got big-time power. Oh, two pitch coming up. Has to play duty in this got him. Back-to-back well, -back strikeouts for Cliff Lee now. Here we go. He's getting zone. locked in. Kind of gives a little extra in some parts of the zone, and then can be tighter in others. But I think the important thing Starting is he doesn't get here. labeled as inconsistent. So you got to stay ready. 94 on the gun, so mid-90s top speed here for, for Cliff Lee. Not an overpowered pitcher. But a guy that is going to, one. you know, get outs for you. And let teams late. hit the ball, yeah, one of those hopefully right you to your to know what to expect, your right? defense here. Exactly. Left hand hitter waits. That's off the Nice change up. Good miss. That's a good miss down low. One down, base is empty. Just missed. Couldn't get him to go after that cutter there. Again, two good pitches were missing up there. Even out the count. See if a two seamer can get in. A foul ball. Right, he off here. Second inning here. Go right no back score. with it. Same pitch here. Got Good him looking. Two down. Three strikeouts in a row now for Cliff. To start the frame, and that's now three in a row. Yeah, he's really that's settling that's in and getting a feel for his pitches, yeah, throwing them where he wants to. All right, to right, all right, now. we're good so here. We'll see how long he can keep this streak going. Kicks and fires. How are we liking the two seamer today and liking this changeup yeah, from Cliff Lee here? See if he can strike out the side. Ooh, Newman fouled it off. Okay. Pass ball up high. Got him. Four in a row, and more importantly, Cliff Lee strikes out the side in the second inning. The the second. All right, Eddie Murray come to bat here. Eddie Murray leading off. The wind of the pitch. The first baseman. Eddie. That one pushed foul. Tried to slap it to the left side. Here we go. Oh, one down. What a high there. Eddie Murray came onto this this Pitch. Cleveland team in the mid '90s when we were smoking the American League, Murray winning Central Division the titles, the getting two World no Series swing. looks. That was James how I grew up watching this squad. You know, winning the AL Central titles, fighting for World Series every year, fighting the Big Bad Yankees, some good it's Orioles it's teams misses. of the mid and yeah, late '90s as well. Some big time teams there. Right to the plate. We had Murray. We had Oral Hershiser at the time. Ooh, that hit him. Might get him at first. Eddie Murray's going to make it, though. Let's make sure that pitcher's okay, huh? Oh, we hit him at. Right? Looks like it hit him in the glove. I think he'll be okay. Larry that brings up Larry Doby here. Yeah, that's, where, that's how I grew up watching this squad. First pitch, Guys like Oral Hershiser, Dennis Martinez on the squad as well. 
pitching for us. The 1 0. Bounce back to Get up now. there. And it's through for a hit. All right. First two men of the inning on. Quickly. First and second now with nobody out. We got Jose Ramirez coming to the plate. One of the four actual current Guardians playing today. There's a swing and a drive. Uh oh, did he make that one or is that one going to get caught? Warning track power, but that's going to advance Eddie Murray over here to third base. So one out and runners on the corners for Cleveland here. Let's see what Grady Sizemore can do. Good eye there to start it. Good eye. Good eye. We didn't go. We didn't go. 2-0 oh now. Got to make you, gotta make you a pitch. Two on, one out. Three and zero. Oh. We're not going to swing. We're going to take a pitch here. No matter what he throws, we're going to take this Dolby. pitch. At first, one gone. There we go. He walked in. Bases loaded now. Four pitches. That's, that's going to bring one. Andres Jimenez, right there, one of the three AL All Stars for Cleveland this year. Here's First pitch, five Jimenez. off here. Here we go. Come on, Jimenez. He's looking All right, for here we go. Make him throw strikes. Out of this jam. Here's a 1-1. One, one. Quickly, 2-1 now. Look, in situations like these, the air can get really thin up there at the Come plate. on, Jimenez. Find a way to breathe and slow everything down. Break this game open. All right, you've seen it now. 2-2. Two and two. Threw a couple sinkers back-to-back here. 2-2 two, two count. Here's the 2-2. Two, two. Ripped on a line to center. That's probably going to score Eddie Murray from third base. Let's see if he has enough speed to make it. He's safe. All right, so Cleveland takes a 1-0 lead in the bottom of the second here. That might be all Cliff Lee needs. We'll have to wait and see as the number nine hitter, Austin Hedges, comes to the plate. Oh, what a play. What a play by the pitcher. That's going to end the inning. That ends the inning. But one run on the board. Here Cleveland has Cleveland, the lead here. New inning getting started. Now it's the veteran outfielder. I did overrule Jake that changeup for a two-seamer here. I will overrule Jake. the pitching and that the catcher every there. once in a while. Well, on paper, but for the most part, I try to let them call the game. Very inning here with two of the three hitters he's set to face batting from the left side, same side he throws from. <laughs> You guys are also new to this series. I am rocking uh, Legends gameplay with all 30 Major League Baseball teams. So uh, I'm doing them in alphabetic order. So check the playlist. If I haven't gotten to your team yet, you guys can always check us out live on Twitch. It's the same handle you're going to find on YouTube, AC Kingpin 27 Make sure you guys are tuning in. We've got some Diamond Dynasty games going, some Road to the Show players. I've got this Legends gameplay. I'm also doing a March to October uh, on stream this year. So a lot of content coming for y'all with MLB The Show. Let's go. Let's get him out here. Let's get Michael Ferris. Let's see if they try to get him into motion. Quickly earn two. Let's see if we can get him. May see some movement over there at first base, trying to stay out of a double play here. Okay, fouled off the changeup. Runner not going anywhere though. They thought about it. Runner at first with no outs here. Got him with a called strike three on the outside corner. Let's go, Cliff. The fifth strikeout of the game here. There we go. Start him off with a strike here. At least for now, allow him to get that call. So hitters are going to have to make an adjustment, but pitchers are going to learn from those things and really try to exploit them if they can. Next offering is in for strike. Count. Ooh, he tried to rip it down the third baseline there, but just foul. The 0-2. That smashed Kenny Lofton should have that, no problem. Nice grab on the run. Two down. All right, two outs now in the third. Now the third baseman, Key Brian Hayes. The third baseman, Key Brian. First pitch. Started off with a, a changeup for well, a ball, huh? Second. 
You want him to go early in the count. That way he's not a distraction to the hitter at the plate. Big go ahead first and get base. out of the way so the hitter can focus on the pitch. At the belt and fire. See what kind of arm Hedges has here. That's See if Hedges can gun start. him down the second base. That gets us out of the third yeah, inning. On to the bottom of the third. Let's see if these Cleveland bats can get another run on the board. Digging in, it's the speedy outfielder, Kenny Long. The center fielder, Kenny. Ripped on a line. Lofton likes to swing on the first pitch by the looks of the bat. Not working out in his favor there. So digging in, Ahmed Rosario. Come on. Rosario. Ooh, try to take it down the line. I wouldn't want to Rosario. And he'll one. Nice hit. And a base hit. So they get a beautiful contact there. Single. Beautiful timing on that ball. And next is the designated. Here comes Jim Tommy. Let's get this power going. Well, but fly out yeah. to the deepest part of the outfield his first time. First yeah, off, bring an adjust misses. Good speed on the base pass. He handles the bat very well. Come on, Tony. Wouldn't be surprised if the skipper puts on some type of hit and run or run Quickly and hit. Quickly 2-0 and to Jim. Next offering misses. Ball two. Oh, yeah. Jim Tomey takes him deep to right field. Let's go. That's a deep drive. Tomey puts it on the board. That makes it three nothing Cleveland here. What a shot too! Look at that swing, beautiful. It's beautiful. It's great to see number twenty-five back in a Cleveland uniform here. Right, that brings up Eddie Murray now. First time up, he reached out about Number thirty-three. Good eye there. And that's ball one. Three nothing Guardians here. That's a base hit up the middle. There we go. Cleveland team starting to hit the baseball. So we're going to try to go quickly five innings so he gets credit possibly for the win. We'll bring in Bly Levin for three and then try to close the door with Feller in the ninth. I like that as a plan for the pitching staff today. So two more innings for Cliff Lee here. And at first, now it's Jose Ramirez. The third baseman. Okay. Two outs for Jay Ram here. Ooh, I'm swinging yeah, the bad pitches now. Wrapped foul. Good eye the there. Pitch is way outside. Murray leads off first with two down to the inning. Kind of do something with this one. And he hits a ground Get up there. Right side. What a play by the they second baseman. That ends the third That's inning, but two out. runs on the Plus board thanks to Jim Chomey's shot. That's what we wanted to see. 3-0 Cleveland here. Key Brian Hayes. I love his first name. Throw him out? No, I'm going to miss it. All right. I think they've had a, a, a runner and almost... Who did we just lose? Andres Jimenez is done. Oh, no. I think we get Miles Straw a look here. No, we're going to let Owen Miller come through. Andres Jimenez is hurt. So Owen Miller is going to come in to play second base. Wow. They're going to sacrifice Sawinski twice today. That's interesting. Sawinski has sacrificed Bunt twice now. So a man on second with Daniel one out. Daniel Vogelback at the plate. The designated hitter, Daniel Vogelback. Swings through that See one. See if we can get out of this unscathed here. So he's been incredibly here. efficient in this one. First pitch strike percentage over 70%. That's well there we above go. the league average. And that's what's allowed him to pitch well up until this point. Stays Ooh, alive. Turned on that one. Got him with the curveball. There we go. Second out of the inning here. I can't believe Jimenez got hurt on that. There we go. Okay. Chavis drafted as a shortstop. 
Okay, quickly go into here. We can go anywhere we want. And the battery wants that curveball, so we're going to try to go down and in to the righty here. Got him reaching. That'll be the third out of the inning. So we kept them all out of the run column. That's what the mat. That's what we're trying to do. All right, Grady Sizemore we're going to lead it off here. The right-hander back to work. Ooh. Ooh, what a play at the hot corner. What a play there. Owen Miller going to get his first look here. Hit the first triple in the park, and another hit the first homer by a Cleveland player. Think you know who they were? Okay, I know that King Jr. hit the first triple here. Yes, he did. First homer for Cleveland. Give me a hand. Switch hitter. That's all you get. Oh, dude. Eddie Murray. No That's right. Bang. That's right. Eddie Murray with the first home run for Cleveland in this ballpark. Swing and a high fly ball to left. That's a quick inning no for trouble. Cleveland. So that takes Puts us through four. A three nothing and ball game here. This will be fifth inning. Fifth, fifth Lee's last inning of work here in the fifth. Lee, like I said, I want to get all the legend pitchers a look here today. So we'll make sure Bly Levin and Feller get to pitch for you. Rosario tosses the first. And the leadoff hitter retired in the fifth. Well, One down. Nice job of keeping the ball out of the, the air. Let's the defense work Captain behind him with another ground ball. Mm. Good execution. Out to short. Rosario, Rosario make two quick plays Collects here. It. Three pitches, two outs. Two set down to the top of the fifth. Now two Maddie, outs, base is empty. Fielder. Now here's Jake, Jake. Marisnik. Marisnik. Let's go, Cliff. In there, and it's 0-1. Well, on the mound, very efficient. Able to produce an outcome, it seems like, within the third or fourth pitch of just about every at-bat. Okay, okay. Quickly 0-2. What are we going to throw? Sharp, just to strike Hedges away wants that fastball. We're going to stay low and outside the here. big lefty turns, kicks, deals. And a foul ball, he stays All right. alive. We're making throw some pitches. We're a little further off the plate this time. Got him. Cliff Lee's going to end it there with a strikeout. His album ends today. Five innings, and he's going to lead in line for the win. So let's go into our bullpen. Let's get Burt Blylevin warmed up and ready to come into the game. We'll try to get him to pitch the sixth, the seventh, and the eighth here today. But Kenny Lofton comes up for his third time. Excuse me. Kenny Lofton, third at bat of the game. And he finally took a pitch. I like it. And the 1-0. That's a double. With his speed, that's a double. No doubt. Let's push three. Let's push three with Kenny Lofton. Got him there. Let's go. A triple to lead off the fifth here. That brings up Ahmed Rosario. Manager might have to go to the bullpen a little bit sooner than he anticipated. Nice curveball there. Nice pretty curveball impressive. There. We haven't seen that pitch from him much, but he's got a really good feel when he throws it. Next one All right, misses. one one count here. A ball one strike. Bullpen action for the Pirates. Couple guys Dylan warming up out Peters there in for Pittsburgh. Preparing to come on if needed. DeYoung getting loose as well. On the ground to Stay third. Fair. And he grabs it foul. Oh, wow. nice right. play. Beautiful play by the third baseman, but that was a foul Everybody ball, huh? Two and two now. Here we go, here we go. Full count now. No outs. Run it on pretty third. Pretty good pitch to hit here with three-hole hitter coming up if he's walked. Kicks and deals. Swing and a ball popped up. Popped up for the shortstop. All right, let's away. see if Jim Tomey can do it again and bring some magic to the Jake. We're going to call it Jacob's the Field today. Let's hitter. see what Tomey can do here. And that's going to be an out, but that's going to score Kenny Lofton from third base. So a 4 nothing game here for Cleveland. That brings up Eddie Murray here. Oh, Eddie Murray takes a deep to left. Into the bleachers. Eddie Murray with a home run. 5 nothing Cleveland here. Turned around a fastball, just took it opposite field. Nice at bat. 
He got hurt by a really good one there, but even a better swing. At the Just play. under 400 feet there, but into the bleachers nonetheless. Larry Dolby. Up next to Cleveland, the left fielder. Larry. Larry Doby's going to be the last out of the fifth. Five nothing Cleveland now as we head to the sixth inning and a new pitcher coming in for Cleveland. Bert Blylevin going to sit on the mound here. 22 years in the major leagues. At this point of the ball game, we're talking about middle innings and a little length out of this arm. See if we can go three innings with Bly Levin. We'll we'll how, how is that a ball? Wait a minute. He just called that a ball. ball one. And that pitch was clearly in the zone. Wow. I was trying to say, we'll go, we're going to try to go three innings with Bly Levin, and we'll try to shut the door with Bob here Feller here. See if it all works out for us. There's a strike. That one's a strike, but the first one's a ball. Look for him to slow it down right Interesting. Here and the count. Next one just misses. Curveball can't get him to chase. And the count is two and two. Right so he's got two deals. different curveballs here. Swings through that one. It's a strikeout. He threw both of them. Strikeout first batter for, for the Blyde Levin. So the batting order turns over. Right and now the, the Pirates ben lead Gamble. off. Man. Ben, ben Gamble. He started in Cleveland here. First pitch and he just nice misses. pitch, man. I'm going to take that miss. That's a beautiful pitch. The 1 0. Swings through that. All right, all right. We're good here. I'm trying to get that outside corner pitch. on our side here. Up there we go. Middle. Owen Miller going to make a play at second base. Over to Two first. outs now in the end. Two quick outs to open the top of the six. Keep Ryan Hayes, the, the next pirate to hit. And he's Keep already Ryan singled in this Come game. Come on. Round there it is. That's the, the third right inning. Side. So Bly Levin with a one, two, three the inning bag. here in the yeah, sixth. See if six, the bats seven. can put up some more runs here. Tyler Beattie Tyler Beattie comes in to pitch for Pittsburgh here. He's going to face J. Ram. You see the shift they have on for him. Is off. Shift playing to the right side of the infield here, but outfield also shading to the right side. Oh, it doesn't matter because Jeremy puts it over all their heads to right center field. You make the fans and we put it in the bullpen. Looks like we put it into the bullpen there. Jay Ram with a home run. Another solo shot for Cleveland. 6 nothing lead now. See if that makes the bullpen. It does. It goes right into the bullpen there. That brings up Grady Sizemore. Oh, Sizemore gets one to right field. That was a hanger. That curveball hung up, and Sizemore takes him deep. Back to back jacks here. That's a line drive home run, too. Right out in the right field. This is the kind of thing where that you brings really up Owen Miller for Cleveland. In a line of feeding off each other and the collective Second confidence base, just continues to grow. Line drive. Ooh, line. line drive out. The third baseman for Pittsburgh making some big time Austin plays today. Now. He's had to make some great plays on the hot there. corner. It's a hot corner for a reason. That's Balls it. come pretty quick at third base. And he swings and misses. That That's the one thing I would love to see Cleveland Still improve upon here out. at the You're trade the deadline. Enemy is grabbing a catcher, uh, whether it's Wilson Contreras uh, for the short term, maybe bringing in a guy like Sean Murphy for the long term. I feel like we've tried to bring catchers in the past, and they haven't wanted to come to Cleveland. I guess the big one that comes to mind is Yasmani Grandal right not yeah. wanting to come from Milwaukee position. a couple years back. He's got it. Um, yeah, but I would love to see a catcher. I know we have some play with Luke Maley. Um, so I just don't know if he's the guy. So I'm interested to see what we do at the trade deadline this year. Bottom of the sixth, two outs. Kenny Lofton getting his fourth at bat of the game here. That's going to be out number three. So we're going to head to the seventh here. Nine outs to go for Pittsburgh to try to make a comeback here. And we still got Bly Levin on the mound, seven. too. At the plate for Pittsburgh, Jack the Sawinski. The left fielder, Jack. And that's a nice pitch. Bly Levin can paint Left those corners wings. if he needs to. And a foul ball, third base side. 
Now, what do you want to see? Fastball high and tight, huh? Swinsky's got some pop. Got to be careful. All right. See how the catcher wanted that pitch up and in. Want to try to tie him up. That's the one thing we're seeing. Go that outside high of it again. You have to get it up there because if got him swinging. First out of the inning down. And he's down on strikes. That's the first now out at the top of the seventh. Hitter. Brings up Vogel back. Vogel back. In the box again. Takes a strike. Let's see if that curveball can drop in here. Next a little bit too low. Stairs. One ball, one strike. Swing Eddie Murray makes the play at first ball. base there. Two outs now. Chavis now. Two. Michael Chavis. And that's in there for strike one. Here we go. Let's go right back down there. All right, quickly 0-2. We can go anywhere you want, wherever you want to see. These guys want the fastball. We're going to go up and in on them then. Hedges calls for the fastball, and he's going to get it. Strikeout to end the and inning. inning is over. Man, Down six outs to go for Pittsburgh, but Cleveland's going to have Chase some at-bats here in the seventh. Big deficit here, but he's still got a job to do. Ahmed so Rosario here to, to Ahmed meet Chase the Youngs here in the seventh inning. And a pitch. Ball one, no First pitch is a ball. Meanwhile, activity in the bullpen. Dylan Peters loosening up in case he's called upon by Derek Shelton. Underwood, good the right-hander, also getting loose. Next All right, two and oh. outside. Make him throw strikes here. Ha! Ah, we got the fastball. We just popped it up. Makes the grab on the run. One away. Nice play by the left fielder coming in there to make it. Jim Tony, Tony comes up for his fourth at bat. Let's see what he can do here. here in this one. Let's see if he gets a hanging curveball or a hanging slider to do some damage with. Swing at high heat. You see high heat, the eyes go wide. Three hits given up by our pitchers today through seven innings. Great pitching performances here. And that one fouled off. And the bats are not slouching at all. Seven runs on the board. Seven nothing Cleveland here. That's ripped. That's gonna base drop in hit. for a base hit. Tommy's two for four today. Eddie Murray going to get another look here. He's three middle. for three you know, today. Dream about. One's in the cage. You're just hoping you get in the ball game. Right, right down the middle, not a whole lot of velocity. Right on top of it. There's a man with 500 home runs in his career. You see it. Five, over 500 home runs in his 21-year career. Murray played for a long time. Ooh, again, the high heat. I see, my eyes get wide. I see dead red. I want to swing. Stands at first with one out. It is again. <laughs> I laugh about it, but I I will go after that high heat. Good eye. We didn't swing. Come on. All right. Two two, two count now. To third and no swing, says James Kingsley. Come on, Murray. Battling here in the seventh. The pitch. Murray. All right, we're safe again. Swing. Full count now. Look to third. And, and no swing, says James and We're going to send Tommy to try to stay out of a double play here. We're not trying for the steal. We're just trying to stay out of a double play. Back to work. 3 2 now. The kick and the pitch. Runner goes. And that's going to drop. Drive, we're going to take go to third. Can we make it? All right, runners on the really corners. One well, out here. What a nice little blue single by Murray the there. The that brings up Larry Doby there. Murray is four for like four Dobie. today. They have a high contact rate and they have more barrels because of that back being on plane. And Larry Doby, the first player great, to integrate the American League enough. here. We all know Jackie like Robinson did it for the field. Dodgers and for Major League Baseball, but Doby was the first one to get into the American League. And here. The 
quickly 2-0 to him. Good spot for the hitter. Definitely has the advantage in this count. count. He's got to throw a strike on. here. Look for him to be aggressive on this next pitch. Righty delivers. That's a base hit scoring a run. Runners on run second and first score. now. There we go. Really bats nice bats coming bat. alive. Jose Ramirez right now. One out in the inning. Little bit early Ramirez. on that curveball. We got and this here. here it comes. And that one is lifted in the right air. center. Does it have Rizzo enough carry? Moving to his left. No, but it will advance Makes the runner to third. So we're going to have runners on first and third. Runner two outs now in the bottom of the seven. And he moves up a base. That's going to bring so up Grady Sizemore. With runners at the see if Sizemore can do some Brady damage Sizemore here in the seven. Digs in for the Guardians. Sizemore. That one left field, left field. does it stay Way fair? No, wall, it doesn't, but a great play to end the inning in here foul territory. All right, July 11 comes up through. for his last inning of work here. An right eight nothing game, oh, yeah. six outs to go for the Pirates. Front the swing, and that is like I said, July 11 will get these last three outs here in the eighth, and we'll bring Rob Feller in for the ninth inning. And a foul ball. Another fastball right requested reliever. by Hedges. Stays right, sound off now. Come on. The wind of the pitch. That one Try to get the pop up. Two seamer outside this time. And your crew is battling here. The O2. This guy could Foul be a future star in the majors right here. Not just for Pittsburgh, but for the major leagues. Could be the next big, big time player we're talking about. Swings and misses. Y Levin sits First him down though. In the top of the Five outs to go the for Pittsburgh. Now, Kevin Newman. Just couldn't catch up on the low 90s now fastball bad. right there, and that's the a result of a good job of Kevin. changing speeds. Mm -hmm. speed All right, starting with the strike. That's what we want to see. We're going to go right back in that same spot. On location and mixing up the speeds. That wasn't the best location with the fastball. Looking Pretty good. Clearly, that wasn't the pitch he was looking for at the plate either. One more down there. Come on. Go Andy all three down and in here. Oh, Newman waited, didn't pull the trigger, and got the ball called. I just don't know how you take that. Why Levin sits him down anyway. Two outs right now, Nate. Two outs, base is empty. Here's the center fielder, Jake Marisnik. Jake Marisnik. And foul okay, he ball. tried. Guardians yeah, close right to continuing our win streak here with his legend team. What a strike call there. Oh, dear. That ball was well off the plate outside. Fly Levin gets a strikeout to end it. So Cliff Lee ended his outing with a strikeout. Fly Levin does the same thing. Three outs to go for the Pirates. We're going to warm up our... Closer, so to speak, Bob Feller here and get him scheduled to come in and work the ninth. So all three of our legend pitchers are going to get work today. Owen Miller going to lead off the bottom of the ninth here. DeYoung, back to work. It's an eight nothing Cleveland lead as the first man in the inning is going to pop out to center field. That's going to bring up Austin Hedges. So it looks like Kenny Lofton... He's Austin actually going to get a fifth at bat in this game. Hedges. Hedges here to end the lineup. Number nine hitter. In the air, right side. A pop up to right Settles field. Under this one. That's Makes two outs the in the eighth for Cleveland. Way down. So two down Kenny Lofton, now. one for four today. His Kenny fifth Lofton. at bat of the game. Let's see if he can get on base here. Yeah, first I, I used to love his swing. 
So this was my little sister's favorite ball player growing up. Uh, she wore number seven in honor of Kenny Lofton, and I loved his swing. It looked like he was slapping at the baseball whenever he was taking in swings. Air, pretty deep out to center field. But he's going to get the third out of the inning, so we're going to head to the ninth. We're going to see Bob Feller coming in here for Cleveland. Cleveland out a new so we saw all three Bob legends Feller. today. Look at Bob Feller coming in and pitching right first time in the majors when he was 17 years old. Well, here's the Pirates catcher now, Michael Perez. And it's crazy, crazy stat outs. line for him, man. He led the majors in strikeouts and in walks uh, for a couple years in a row. Kind of crazy. Oh, no. We'll have to make the play, baby. Oh, we almost made a patent in Kenny Lofton play. But Bob Filler gives up a solo shot on the curveball to Michael Perez. Not a good look for us here. Not a good look at all. Let's see. All right, so number one hitter for Pittsburgh going to get his fourth at bat of the game. Let's see if we can throw that curveball again. Let's see if we can get a, a strike with it this time. No, Gamble knocks it. Nice cutoff by Doby. Holds Gamble at first base. Let's settle down here with Keith Brian Hayes, the next pirate to hit. Number 13. Keith Brian. Hot shot to third. Wow. And there's a hit. Three guys up, three hits on off Feller here. Lead runner to wow. second, so two on and nobody out. All right, Bob, I need you to settle down with a little bit, man. Jack Jack. And there's a foul ball. Can't have you giving this up, man. Gamble. At second, Hayes. At first, with no outs. Well, Feller's How is that not a strike? Not a pitcher to face. Rocket fastball, tons of movement, and very hard to pick up out of okay, his Okay, there we go. So, a foul ball makes it one and two. Throw that change up for you here. Next get him to get a ground ball. Let's see if we can turn two here. Anytime you've got a guy who leads the league in strikeouts and walks in four different seasons here we like go. Feller did. Four seasons he led the majors in strikeouts and walks. Or you're ducking. That's crazy. And a swing and a miss. All right, we struck him out here. Let's go. One out in the inning. Let's settle down here, fellas. Two on with one out. Daniel Vogelback digs in down. Foul ball. Daniel I need that ground ball double play to end it. Two on, one out. On the ground. That might be it. To second for one. Double play is going to end the game. Cleveland's going to walk away with an eight. To one win here against the Pittsburgh Pirates. Way to go, Cleveland. The legends coming up big time in this game. Then we have home runs by Tommy, home runs by Sizemore, home run by Eddie Murray, and of course, Jose Ramirez had to get the home run today. Player of the game is Cliff Lee coming in with the win. Uh, looks like we did get to pitch with Bly Levin and Feller as well. So you guys got to see all the legends that are available. Uh, for this Cleveland Guardians team. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the gameplay today. Stay tuned to the channel for more. We're going to have more legends come at you. Next on tap is going to be the Colorado Rockies. So be ready to see guys like Larry Walker, Dante Bichette, Vinny Castilla, and more. I'm looking forward to getting that gameplay in as well. But uh, definitely thank you guys for tuning in and watching. Like I said, there's always content coming. March to October, the Legend Series. We've got Diamond Dynasty grind. If you guys aren't checking out the content here on YouTube, make sure you guys are checking everything out on Twitch when we go live. Appreciate you guys all being here. As always, guys, I'm AC Kingpin 27 Like I said, I appreciate you guys all being here. Thank you so much for showing love on the video. Stay safe out there, and I'll catch every one of y'all next time.